When you have designed the data foundation and business layer for your universe, you can use the automatic integrity check option to detect any errors in the connection, structure of tables and joins, and business layer components of a universe. This avoids problems when running reports at a later date. In this tutorial, you will run an integrity check on a universe. Note that this tutorial was recorded using SAP Business Objects Information Design Tool 4.0, version 14.0.0, v2010-1019-0760. To navigate, use the viewer controls or follow the on-screen instructions, if available. You can access the check integrity function in different ways, depending on the object or layer you want to check. For any selected object, you can right-click and select Check Integrity. For an open resource that is currently in focus, you can click the Check Integrity button in the toolbar. Click Check Integrity. The Check Integrity dialog box displays all the rules that can be checked for the active view. As the business layer is the last resource created, all integrity rules appear in the list. Check if the connection to the data source and all universe resource dependencies are set up correctly. Select the Connections and Dependencies checkbox. Verify that all tables, including alias and derived tables, are set up correctly in the Data Foundation. Select the Tables checkbox. Verify that all joins, contexts, and cardinalities are set up correctly in the Data Foundation. Select the Joins checkbox. Click to scroll down. Verify that all objects and filters are set up correctly in the business layer. Select the business layer checkbox. Verify that all lists of values and prompts are correctly defined in the universe. Select the parameters and lists of values checkbox. Click check integrity. When a check is completed, the result is displayed. There are three types of check results. An error icon indicates that the integrity check has detected something that will not work. You must resolve the problem. A warning icon indicates a missing object, such as a missing key or link. An information icon indicates that the integrity check was successful. In this example, a warning message appears regarding a missing key. Exit the integrity check dialog box and resolve the issue. Click OK. Click the Club DFX tab. Insert a primary key for the customer table. Right-click the Cust ID column. Click Set as Key. Select Primary. Click Save. Return to the Business Layer view and run another Integrity check. Click the Club BLX tab. Click Check Integrity. Select the appropriate options to check the universe integrity. For this tutorial, these have already been selected. Run the integrity check. Click check integrity. The integrity check does not return any errors. Click OK. You have successfully run an integrity check on a universe. This is the end of the tutorial.